So as you can tell, Lauren's skin is very flawless and airbrushed. So to achieve that look, I'm going to be taking this Lancome foundation, and I do not know how to pronounce that, but I'm pretty sure that's the name of it. I'm at a payphone trying to go home all of my change I spent on you. And then I'm going to be taking my NARS Laguna bronzer, and it's not this brush, this brush. This is a Bare Minerals powder brush, and I'm just going to be putting this on my cheeks. Just to kind of enhance my cheekbones and my chin. Just very lightly dusting it on, and also my forehead. Just where the sun kind of naturally hits your face. Next, using my Clinique Instant Lift for brows, I'm going to fill in my eyebrows just using little sweeping motions to give them a little more definition. And then, whoops, like so. I'm going to take my Revlon Color Stay Liquid Eyeliner and I'm going to do a little wing out on the top. So I'm just going right along my lash line and then I'm going to give it a little flick. Really super small and barely noticeable. Then I'm going to be taking my Makeup Forever Aqua Eyes Eyeliner and this is in, oh boy, does it have a color? I don't think it does, but it's black. So, yeah. And I'm just going to be using this on my waterline and my lower lash line. And I'm going to connect it with the little wing. just so it's really subtle. Then I'm going to curl my eyelashes. And a mascara that I'm going to be using is this Dior Mascara and it has like a really really big applicator and it looks like it'd be really really volumizing, but it's actually a great lengthening mascara. I'm just going to be applying this to my outer lashes just for that really pretty like fairy effect that Lauren has going on in the photo. So there are my lashes and then you can kind of compare them to hers that are really wispy and fun. And then I'm going to be putting a little bit on my bottom, on the outer ones. Again, just for that really wispy, fairy-like effect. As for blush, Lauren is actually wearing the Maybelline Dream Bouncy Blush in Pink Plum. And so why not use that? I'm just going to be taking it on my fingers and just kind of rubbing it on my cheeks. Mainly on the apples on my cheeks. And for the lips, you can play around with the lips, use any product that you would like. She just has on a really nice, pretty, like, light pinkish nude gloss, so just play around with it. And I know my eyeliner, I don't know if people are going to notice it or not, but it kind of bugs me. My eyeliner is, like, thicker than hers looks, so um, if, that, if you notice that or it bugs you or whatever, I'm sorry. But you can always take a Q-tip and some maybe oil and just um, go right along the top like where your eyeliner is and it just takes off the really thick stuff and leaves the stuff on your lash line. So anyway, um, here is the finished look. I really hope you enjoy it. So thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you all later. Bye!